Blind Energy Reading Quickies. Thank you for joining me, allowing me in your experience, participating this co-creating energy of oneness by listening live, archive, requesting energy reading and healing. This is June Universe at Ninja Intuitive. Three minutes blind energy reading quickies. So today I would like to give my focus on the energy flow of here now as unlocking your divine realms. Unlocking your divine realms. Being part of this year 2018, which is a numerologically the number 11. If you are familiar with this energy of 11, yes, that's the magical number, karmic number, gateway opening number. So I'd like to turn into this energy of the flow of this year as to give in my focus on unlocking your divine realm. I'm excited how I'm going to channel this focus. <laughs> Thrilled to see what is coming down to share with this co-creating energy of oneness. So stay tuned for that. After conscious breathing exercise, doing weekly check-in to connect in yourself, each part of you, your mind, body, emotional body, physical body, here now. Basically, consciously noticing where you are, what you are at this present moment here now. And let my voice guide the quickest meditation, breathing exercise. We do it together to connect individually, oneness in local, and connect this field of energy, oneness, a unity. So that would help us, each of us, participate to help one another adjusting a chosen state of beingness. And last portion of the show, as usual, I would like to give three minutes intuitive blind reading request it through that web page at www.thatfuturefocus.com you can also request that personal reading without telling me private information just follow in the instruction as in a blind reading. This is the gift from me to you as a free charge. And what you receive is the three minutes of information, insight that I turn into your energy, which I've been doing over the last uh, 13 years. And normally a private session over the phone. But here you can get the free. I provide a free reading. Why? Because your request give me an opportunity for each of us to connect as one energy. And I appreciate you allow me to share your insight with others so others can learn about 
the choices if they are noticing the similar situation. And at the same time, you can receive the healing energy from all the listeners in this oneness, unity, the good thought about your chosen creation. So each participant of this field of oneness work on our own needs and support each other in a way that we can. So the listener you can join to learn and also to send a good thought and receive the energy support as in a community to your own chosen creation. And then also I offer that guided meditation so you can use that guided connecting exercise to yourself for your well-being. It's nice to have um, together energy to do something better for yourself chosen by you. So that's what I, I uh, have to offer for free. And what I really appreciate is to sharing what we do here with your community. I know this is not for everyone, but it benefits for those who are in need. So uh, please share. Then I was thinking about where would be the most uh, easiest way to share is um, YouTube archive. If you can uh, share that link at YouTube, June Universe, one word, June Universe at YouTube. And there is a weekly podcast archives. And uh, there is a special event for love and soul connections and also meditation sessions. So share and uh, subscribe if you um, help us grow as a uh, community. And like to let us know that you joined and you are supporting the energy of oneness. I truly appreciate that your participation sharing in a community through that YouTube channel. Thank you. So let me start the conscious breathing exercise being current. If you can get your favorite drink in handy, I highly recommend you to do so. And then also pen and paper handy to write that down. Information coming out from you, not to write what I am sharing, but what you are noticing. And that is the valuable information for you here in this oneness. I am having a tea, black tea tea it's getting cold already and having a wonderful day here at the second almost getting into the third week of January 2018 so uh, let my voice guide your attention to being current here now, getting to know where you are, where I am, where we are at this present moment, and connect to self, each part of you, and also in this energy of oneness. All right, so... Just relax and um, being active about your sense of sensing what you are noticing, observe yourself. And give your attention 
from top of your head and all the way down to the toe. All right. So give your attention to top of your head, what you are noticing. I am noticing my top of my head, the hair. I made a little、uh, bow on top of my head, tied the hair. So that's getting my attention physically. And,、uh, and then just to notice what you are thinking. Where is your thought connecting at here now? I am、um, taking it into the. Thought of what I did last night, so seems to be aligning to the past. And what about you? Are you thinking about yesterday or a week ago, a month ago, holiday season just came through, or about tomorrow, or today, or a week from now, or next month, or the vacation coming in summer, or just noticing what your mind is、uh, connecting. And notice what your eyes are capturing in front of you, in your space. And what about mind eyes? What is your mind eyes is connecting? Connecting some event or people or experience from the past or when is it? The time, location, just to notice what your mind or imagination is taking. To、uh, wishful thinking, or just observe and to the nose, smelling something, your nose. I'm smelling the fresh air and the incense I just burned. So, about the taste in your mouth. What about your throat? Noticing the temperature inside of your mouth and then into your body. Noticing the neck outside, inside. Is any a tightness or something getting your attention? Extend it into the shoulders, right shoulders and left. Just to notice and inside under the skin, your muscle tightness or soft. What is noticing towards the arms extended towards the elbows? I'm noticing the heaviness on left shoulders. Into the arms, all the way down to the hands. What about the temperature of your hand? Is that warm, cold? What about the skin, dry, moist? What about your palms and fingertips? I got the broken nails on my、uh, right middle. Nails, fingernails, and just clipped it. That minimizes the damage, makes me happy. So, just that、uh, what is noticing bring you any feeling? So, just notice what you're noticing, and then your awareness coming back to the upper arms. Armpits and coming to the center of your body trunk. We may want to place our hands on top of our chest. Feel the temperature on your palm. And notice what your hand is noticing, sensing when you placed on your chest. And your awareness is going underneath of the skin, rib cage, and into the lungs. Feel the size of your lungs, 
and the heart pumping blood how do you feel there noticing inside the rib cage what kind of image is coming to your awareness and to slowly down to the stomach and the belly bringing up to the back of your neck and feel the weight of your head and connecting point to the neck and shoulders and how your neck is holding your weight of the head face everything and notice the connection join the bone spine follow the spine slowly from top of your back and going down slowly towards the lower back back of your lungs and slowly down the stomach and to the back of your kidneys going down towards the pelvic area and feel the connection if you are sitting your bottom and the seat how you feel about the connecting point your gravity and notice the joint to the legs and extend it into the both legs towards kneecap how you feel the temperature and outside of your leg towards knees and slowly going down towards the feet ankles heels all the way down to the toes i'm barefoot i'm a barefoot lover and i feel the connection your feet to the floor and to the ground extend your awareness following the gravity connected to the floor and the ground and the earth and into the center of the earth now fully connected to the mother earth Thank you. So now I would like you to notice your beingness. What kind of uh, feeling you are with? The mood. Maybe it's already changed, shifted from the beginning after this being current exercise. So the uh, feeling now you are with, noticing, choosing one word. When you notice the feeling, we are using the right brain. Your right side of brain is noticing your feeling. Okay, you're noticing what kind of feeling you are feeling. And choose the word that resonates into your feeling. Choosing, selecting the word is using your left brain. So using both sides, noticing your feeling and then choosing the word is using balancing way of our brain. So which is useful and practical to know where we are. So, and another thing, write that word down with the pen and paper. Not so digital, but using the handwriting and piece of paper would uh, bring more effectiveness to what we would like to connect to here now with uh, detachment. 
something taken out from our body would help us get to know about us with a little bit of space to our intimate self because we are so intimate right so use this tool writing pen and paper and choose the word i'm talking too much and so the feeling you are with i feel calm calm actually how about you actually when i preparing the podcast today I noticed that myself is pretty negative, you know, it's, uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's kind of a trend for uh, several days that a negative spiral, I'm noticing it, lucky, lucky me, um, but now I feel calm, calm, how about you, write that down, unless you're driving, Okay, so now the second feeding word I would like you to choose. What kind of feeding you would like to have using a together moment, energy of oneness. At the end of today's gathering, today's show, what kind of feeding you would like to feel with you? I like to have uh, clarity. Feeding bliss. <laughs> That's interesting. I don't choose much word. Blissful. Bliss. Blissful feeling. How about you? Any feeding word would be good. Such as, I, f- I want to feel loving or caring or I feel compassionate or um, energized, exciting, accomplished, all of these good. So just um, be creative about noticing your exciting or the feeling you like to be with. And choose the word using the personal power. You choose that. Okay. So then let us um, do the conscious breathing exercise. Quickest meditation that we can do anytime we want to. What to what we are going to do is to open our eyes, which is quite unique for a meditation exercise, but eyes open wide awake and consciously breathe in from your nose slowly and keep it in your body, lungs and bring that air down to the stomach as if balloon inside is make it bigger with the air intaking from your nose and keep it inside of your body as much as you can as long as you can and then let that out slowly from your mouth okay let me uh, guide that conscious participation to this breathing with my voice shall we Okay, so let us take a long, deep breath, counting three, one, from the nose, go, two, three, hold it in your lungs. Stomach, keep it. One more time and taking all the air around you, the energy 
resonating to your chosen feeling in taking all the way to your lungs and stomach inside of your body and notice how the body inside of you resonating to this newly intaken fresh energy chosen by you and then let that out slowly from the mouth all right let us take a long deep breath Counting three, one, now from the nose, go, two, three, hold it, circulate it, all the energy inside of your body. The last one with the silence. I would like to embody that feeling that you chose for today's、um, resonance you like to experience using together moments. Do you remember your word? Mine is a blissful. Bliss. So, embody that word, the feeling you chose using this all together moment in taking the air around you, energy from the nose, and keep it circulated inside of your body as if the balloon inside is filled with the energy chosen by you and let it out slowly, completely. Releasing with no longer serving whatever coming from your past. All right, with the silence, shall we? Ready? Let's do that. Go. Thank you for joining conscious breathing exercise, being current here now. This is June Universe at Ninja Intuitive Three Minutes Blind Energy Reading Quickies. Ooh. I feel so refreshed. How about yourself? Those of you who just joined as a live listener, welcome to our community, Energy of Oneness. And I just want you to know that maybe you are hearing the silence. And what is this silence? We are doing a conscious breathing exercise. And if you're interested in this quickest meditation to be in current, actually, it helps. It's been helping me. So that's what I'm providing to do it together every week. So check the archive at the YouTube. You can join this conscious breathing exercise when you need, anytime. You need, even if you're driving, you can join to help yourself being current, especially when you are challenged by emotional、um, turbulence or physical busyness. Want to be connected to the best sense of self, neutralize it. So, Google, YouTube. 
Jun Universe, one word. Jun Universe, one word. And please subscribe if you like it. And、uh, click like to let us know you are joining. So that h e l p us become more energized as the unity of oneness, the field of un- oneness. Together we are stronger. So thank you for your participation. So, today's focus I like to give is the unlocking your divine realm. Unlocking your divine realm. So, what is、um, divine realm anyway? What is your divine realm anyway? Interesting. This is the Year 2018 is the numerologically the number 11. Yeah, number 11. Yeah, if you're familiar with this, 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 <laughs> this energy <laughs> is the 11. You can Google it, it's many information about the energy of the number 11. And、uh, find what、uh, area r e s o n a t e to your experience now. So, today this caught my attention, and、um, third week of the January, I've been noticing after the holiday season that I、um, kind of.、Uh, Resonating, vibing in、uh, instable compared to the previous. That's because I think that it's a new energy. So, when we experience it new, at the very beginning, is、uh, unfamiliar. That's natural to any kind of newness. And uh, uh, it requires Moments of connection and dedication to become familiar, and and then we become more better using of that newness, and then and then becoming the master in the way to utilizing what's available as an energy. So I was drawn to the word balance. One of the reasons that drawing to this particular word balance is that my life lesson is、uh, kind of balance from many different uh, um, approaches to get the reading about yourself. Let's say that energetic reading, intuitive reading, numerological reading, astrological reading, whatever that approach is to get in. To know about what we are, what I am, what you are. Balance seems to be a、um, life lesson, one of the life lessons that、uh, for this lifetime of mine. And however, this energy of 11, it's actually a gateway opening and to that new frequency. and It's a perfect energy to exercise in the balance. You know, one, one, the polarity is both s i d e and the balance. And it's just like a Libula energy that to, it's not good or bad, but just a see and so. And the balancing way and enjoy the light, and how are we going to blend in into the oneness in a balanced, harmonious way? And this year, 2018, seems to contain in this energy of balance in a new way. So, some part of us revealing the true voice. Inside of us, become more aware of what excites us within. And 
allowing the part to show an experience with earthy reality with sharing with others let's say what excites you most and more and more allowing that part of your desire to come into the physical experience shareable form with others and that old created self and the newly Revealing part of you as your new reality, new reality you is always in a balancing point here and now. And it is so wise to utilize the energy around us as the flow with our cosmic energy, the universal flow that is number 11 this year. So Let us be come familiar with this gateway opening newness, number 11 energy, and balancing the sense of self into the gateway open new reality chosen by you. How we know that is the feeding, paying attention to the feeding. What makes you feel good, excited? What is making you feel in the other way, negative spiral? Just observe here now this point to make a balance, both sides and embrace. In order to do so, not cover in up, unlocking your potential. And divine realm, whatever that would that be, revealed by your here now, witness you at this present moment. Do you remember the feeding that you chose for today's? Mine is blissful. So, to embody that feeding, notice both sides. Dark side of you and bright side of you, and feel that balance here now to be in that new frequency, chosen experience in your new reality. Gateway can be opening here now at this present moment. It's up to you to choose this energy to transform the experience more aligned with chosen state who you are by you. This is Journey Universe at Ninja Intuitive Three Minutes Blind Energy. Reading quickies. Energy of 11. I love that. So, I like to give the intuitive reading using three minutes. We have another six minutes, so quickly to set the timer. Today, I like to give the、uh, life path reading. So, during the reading I am given, I would like you to embody the feeling you chose for today's gather in for yourself. Mine is blissful. Yours are y o u r chosen by you. And send a good thought to the energy reading requester as if they are experiencing the perfect way in their life. And then I am also bringing the healing request that I'm receiving at this present moment and embodying that perfect experience in your healed state. Multiple tasking using this together moments, okay? So、um, the first reading I'd like to give is from the life path, three minutes. And.、Uh, The symbol is poppy. Poppy? Okay. Poppy. 
I got the sense that your life path is becoming so much clearer there in the last three months, looks like. And I got the sense that、uh, blue sky, crystal clear, and that little bit of filter to protect, to see that. Um, how far you came doing the work. Great job. I'm noticing the、um, few elements as a red spotting, as a、uh, getting attention. That could be、um, earthy fruit that you are ready to pick, and also the one that ready to returning back to the soil. As an, uh, uh, as an investment or as an energy return system. So、um, make the balance of taking it as an, a fruit and enjoy it, and then returning some of the fruit into、uh, coming to nurture in the fundamental foundation that you've been creating for the last three years.、Um, this makeover stage is really earthy, connected to a sense of natural,、uh, mature awareness. and Feeling grounded and crystal clear, and it's very light, so、uh, it's been shareable with others, and in a way that、uh, effortless almost. So, stay focused on what you've been doing and honor in your creation, and be wise to、um, use that. Energy you got here for the next phase, which is for 2018, as a leaping, leaping year based on what you've been creating for the last three years. Good luck. Thanks for your request. This is the poppy, the category of the life path. The next reading I would like to give is the flash. Flash. Okay, flash. I got the sense that flashy feeding is now stable and it seems to be a creative realm. And、uh, integrating your power of creativity, and it's a time to convert that energy into that、uh, relate. Relationship in a way that、uh, business and community and convert that into the financial creativity.、Um, I got the sense that there is a childhood experience was、um, blocking you to allow that creativity to be in up to now, but. It's good for you to reconnect in to the sense of self when you are five years old, child. It's the、uh, pure joy, and that you can be a perfect partner to encourage that creativity in a way that mature sense of responsibility. Good luck. That's a short reading, but the energy of、um, the reading, the symbol of the flash. The category of life path. You can also request your own curious matter wondering about about your life. Go into www.thatfutureforecaster.com. Thatfutureforecaster.com. Look forward to intuiting your needs. How's your embodiment of your feeling? Let us take a deep breath here now. And slowly. Thanks for joining. I see you next time. This is June Universe. Until then, all my love and healing to your heart.